Here's a quick introduction to the queue list in VPT6. The queue list allows you to uh, make transitions between presets and also build more complex uh, sequences. It's using uh, some very uh, basic tools which you can combine in different ways. So you have the cut command which goes directly to uh, a preset and it's capital C and it's always space between the different parameters N. So I want to say I want to cut to uh, preset 4 for instance. So I switch to play mode to actually execute the queue list. I just click on the item I want to uh, try out and it basically just jumps uh, uh, to the preset I chose. So let's just try another one just to make sure it works. Since I'm in the play mode, when I hit enter, it actually is ex executed immediately. So it might be uh, smart to stay in edit mode. If I want to do fade between two uh, presets, I use capital F space from presets to presets and fade time. I switch to play mode, I click on it, and you get a fade. If I want to do more complex things, I can add, for instance, a delay time. So if I do the cut to 14, I want to add a delay. Oops, I'm in the play mode. I want to add a delay of 3 seconds. Then I want to cut to uh, 15. Cut to 15, oops, add another delay, 3 seconds. And what you would expect then is that it would cut to 14, but since I haven't told it to actually continue to the next uh, element, I need to specify that. And the way you do that is very simple. You just add a plus, again separated with a space. Uh, this tells the queue list to uh, continue to the next element when it has executed it. This is not necessary for the delays because they automatically assume that you would jump to the next level. So let's see how this works. The reason I added the last delay there is because I wanted to show you the, the loop uh, command as well. This tells me to loop back to the first element in the queue list, so this number is not related to preset number. So let's try this. To turn off the loop, you just switch back to edit mode. It is also possible to um, work with the uh, queue lists uh, in a text editor. Uh, you can either open one from file, for instance uh, I have one uh, included in the demo project called a bit uh, strange name maybe, VPT text. If you open it the queue list gets filled up. Uh, you can work with the queue list in uh, either an external text editor, but also inside uh, VPT, which makes it much more flexible in terms of uh, changing and adding lines in between, etc. You should just remember to keep uh, the last line of the queue list, you should uh, have an end in capital letters. So to open the editor, you just click on the open editor button, let's just move it into the view here, and there you can basically change remove whatever you want to do. I recommend using the close editor button because that immediately updates the queue list. Uh, if you don't uh, use the um, the button, now I've changed a little bit more here. 
if you don't use the button because maybe the window is here is covering the button and you close it like this the queue list does not get updated until you click on the update queue list for more information about the queue list take a look at the queue list help